ISTQB Foundation Level Question 51. Which of the following can be the root cause of the bug in a software product? 1. The project had incomplete procedures for configuration management. 2. The time schedule to develop a certain component was cut. 3. The specification was unclear. 4. The use of the code standard was not followed up. 5. The testers were not certified. Answers. A. 1 and 2 are correct. B. 1, 2, 3 and 4 are correct. C. 3, 4 and 5 are correct. D. 1, 2 and 4 are correct. Please press pause to choose your own answer before you see the correct answer on the screen. Correct answer is B. 1, 2, 3 and 4 are root causes of a bug in a software product. Let's take a closer look at all the statements from 1 to 5 to find a valid root cause. Statement 1 is valid because incomplete procedures can lead to versioning problems and incorrect configuration, potentially causing bugs. Statement 2 is valid because rushed development due to time constraints can result in oversights, implementation errors and bugs. Statement 3 is valid because unclear specification can lead to misunderstandings and implementation errors. Statement 4 is valid because not following coding standards can lead to inconsistence and errors in the code, which can manifest as bugs. Statement 5 is invalid because uncertified testers is not always a direct root cause of a bug. Certification alone does not guarantee effective testing and bugs can still occur even with certified testers if the testing process is inadequate or other factors are at play. So, it's easy to find right answer excluding statement 5 from the other answers. Notice, K-point. Typically phrases like uncertified testers a refer to incorrect answers. Explanation. Finally, let's look at the section 1.2.3 errors, defects, failures and root causes in the ISTQB syllabus, where we can see the last paragraph referring to root cause. I suggest you check it out for yourself. This question is not difficult for you, because you are a very talented and logical thinking person. I am entirely sure you will definitely pass the ISTPB foundation level with flying columns. Never give up!